Hello everybody, this is Stream Gaming Year for a Jurassic World Evolution 2 Battle Royale. Yes, the one that I had initially planned for Halloween, but it's kind of, well, Thanksgiving now if you live in America. Or, or Canada, Canada, I think. <laughs> but yeah, a month late, but better late than never, eh? And the, the one of the benefits of it being a lot later than I expected is that I managed to put in more dinosaurs. And yes, we have Dinosaur King Dinosaurs, of course, because that's, the, that's my specialty. It's the only thing I do. <laughs> so yeah, we got this beautiful, spanking, sexy arena here. Lots of cool little stuff. Got this Colosseum from the Lost World. We got this little pavement -y area. We got the iconic picturesque fountain there from the Minion. And yeah, this is going to be a d very unique battle royale because for the first time ever... As you can see here, we are going to include flyers. So we have the Quets. Yes, I teased this guy ages ago and I finally finished it. And he has already been released so he could break out of the Avery and cause some carnage. Now, I hope it went better than the testing session. When I tested this, for some reason, the Quets decided to just fly and chill over by here. But I have put a uh, Pisophore feeders here. So that will hopefully entice the Quets to come into the arena. Where we'll hopefully see it kill stuff. <laughs> um, there's also some carnivore feeders, just two though, and a goat feeder. Because yeah, why not? So yeah, without further ado, let's release all the dinosaurs and boy we got some new ones. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, this is the first one returning from Jurassic World Evolution 1 over into Evolution 2. We have the Ankylosaurus. I think our first Ankylosaurid in this kit that I've made for this game. I am working on others as well, because I'm going to focus more on herbivores for Christmas. But don't worry, there'll be some new carnies as well. There's a Pachycephalosaurus coming in there. I still need to apply the Lux effect, but yes, one of the more notable features you will see about this guy as well <laughs> bar my poor effort to get rid of the spikes on the side <laughs> is the fact that it's a lot flatter than the uh, Jurassic Park 3 one because I find the Dinosaur King one very flat and not very spiky so yes this is Ankylosaurus and another notable feature which you'll probably notice a lot of in these fights ooh it's weird don't know why I was doing that is well the, the, the stats are very very broken as you can see and this, it has something to do with the new species. Not all of them, but some of them do break the traits, trait effects. So instead of it being like, you look at Skittish, for example, when it loses 50% dominance, that's like, that is instead, it loses 150% dominance. So well, as far as I can see, the, the stats are tripled. The effect is tripled. So over here, instead of it being 30%, it would be 90%. And then you get a gist. So yeah, as a result of these traits, this thing has a dominance of four. <laughs> Can't see this guy doing well, can I? Can you? Although, dominance is not everything. Okay, another newcomer. This Well, this one making its debut here on the channel. Ladies and gentlemen, one of my fan favourites. Well, one of my favourites, I should say. The Gondwana Titan. Yes, I finally got around to doing it. The little sauropod with a big heart. And oh my god, that is, what is that? Is that a para? Yes. <laughs> Thank you, para, for basically blocking the whole view. But look, look, how, tiny, look how tiny it is compared to a para. <laughs> oh, bless him. Bless this. Oh my god. It is literally the little sauropod. He's so tiny in this game. In Dinosaur King. And I made it tiny in this game. I, have, I had actually had a plan to use the Stegosaur rig so it could fight. But the problem I had was that, if I pause the game real quick, 
was that the hump of the stegosaur went up like that. So when I cleared all the spikes, it just looked like a naked stegosaur, even with the extended neck and tail. So yeah, I decided to go with a Margosaurus in the end. Ho I'm hoping and willing one day that Frontier will add new animations to get these sauropods to fight. But until then, they just got to put up with being basically whipping fodder. Right, another one making its debut here. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Delta Dromius. Delta Dromius, one of the... Oh my god, what have I done to the fingers? <laughs> um, oh dear, I think I broke the fingers. Oh god, I looked at this in Species Viewer earlier, it was fine. Oh dear. <laughs> As you can see by the broken ass fingers, weight painting is not really my specialty. Well, not when it comes to doing fingers and such. But yeah, that's kind of a shame, but I'll fix that. But yes, this is Delta Dromius. One of the very last mods I made for Jurassic World Evolution 1. Returning into Evolution 2. Making his debut here. We'll see how well he fares. Let's have a look at his stats. Oh my god, 397 attack. And that is why, look at that. Okay, one more making its debut here. In both games, ladies and gentlemen, Tajongosaurus. The king of the crits itself will definitely make an impact. Well, we'll see because, yes, yes, it will definitely, this will definitely make an impact. Of course, when I play tested earlier, it didn't make much impact. And yes, you can see straight away that uh, <laughs> the tail, this tail spike is a bit broken and I can't seem to figure out why. Even, even though I weight painted all these pretty well there. Even though I weight painted all these spikes pretty well. Well, by my standards anyway. Well, yeah, Myasaura making her debut here as well. And what would be a bit, what would be a Myasaura without her papa? Yes. For those of you that have watched the Myasaura episode, you know she has a baby and it looks like this. So we've included baby Myers. Because why not? I mean, they're going to die in horrific deaths, but, you know, it's a battle royale, isn't it? Got to, got to die somehow. There's a Guanodon there. Some of these um, have received updates. Model Officeaurus making his debut as well. Slight little tweak on the crest a bit, make it look more like the one from Dinosaur King. Okay, Parasaurolophus has received a slight tweak. Stretching the crest out a bit more, straightening it out. Giving it a bit more of a sail on the back there with the blue. Okay, also returning, we have Despletosaurus. A very chunky Despletosaurus. Yeah, look at that. It looks really good. I really like how this turned out. I made it. I made the Despletosaurus a little bit chunkier than the Albertosaurus, but it is slightly smaller. I have shrunk it down a tad bit, so yeah. Albertosaurus is still slightly bigger. Another dinosaur making its debut here, the Sukumimus. Sukumimus could be a dark horse in this, especially with the 800 dominance. Especially with those crazy stats. Let's actually have a look. Okay, yeah, Sukumimuses could make an impact. Uh, Metriacamphosaurus has finally received its model update to look more like the Dinosaur King one. Spinosaurus here has received a slight texture update and a slight model tweak. Ooh, oh, you're a good one. 1067 dominance. Ooh, could Spinosaurus win again? Uh, also, another herbivore which could make an impact. Woohoosaurus. Ooh, ooh, you're quite good. This Woohoosaurus could be a dark horse as well. Right, here's a dinosaur that can make an impact. The Deinonychus. Returning from its absence in the last one. I've also edited the model so it looks a bit more skinnier than the uh, Deinonychus I had before. And yeah, head crest kind of wavers a bit. And it, and it should really because I think it's more of a quillage than an actual crest. So I don't mind that. And when, when we're able to add feathers to models, I will definitely feather this dude up. Yeah, now these Deinonychus, with the uh, broken traits of stats and that, could be a problem. Yeah, especially because they can pack hunt as well. So these Deinonychus could be a slight issue here. They could be ones to watch. So long as they all don't die. Tyrannosaurus Rex, has again like Spinosaurus, has received a slight model update and a slight texture update make it look a bit more reddish Ooh, oh look at this one 900 dominance okay this t-rex could be one to watch what about the other one Ooh, this one's a powerful brute as well could we see a t-rex win right that's enough jibber jabbering about all that 
let's get on with this and let's get on with it with the perspective of the quets oh look at this quets standing high and mighty over his kingdom here will this quets mind a kill in this battle royale well i hope so otherwise there would be no point of having it and yes the quets can't actually be killed by anything else which is kind of a shame it would be so cool if it like landed when it landed it could get like attacked by a t-rex or something because I mean, look at it. Even though the Quetz is bloody huge, a T-Rex could just destroy it. Hell, even something like a Deinonychus would do see severe damage to it. Ooh, here we go. Our first fight. And his Monolophosaurus going down to the Carno. Yes, these Monolophosauruses are probably not going to last very long. Ooh, we got Triceratops against the T-Rex here. Triceratops getting a hit. But I think these T-Rexes are quite powerful, so I don't see the Triceratops winning. No. Yeah, yeah, the T-Rex definitely won. Oh, and he's got a damaged tooth. Not a good start. Although, you are quite a strong Triceratops. Ooh, look at these. Let's have a look at these Triceratops stats. Okay, this could be the one. TRC-11 could be the MVP. Oh, this one as well? Ah, oh, he's sleeping. Okay, this one maybe not so much. Pentaceratops taking on Supermimus. Ooh, Deinonychus against Monolophosaurus. Ooh, not looking good for Pentaceratops there. Getting lacerated by the Suko. Ooh, look at these two having a fight on next to the cars. And I think that is Deinonychus going down. Monolophosaurus landing a blow. Killing one of the Deinonychus, which is not good for the Deinonychus pack. Yes, I think these Deinonychus need these Monos to die quick so that they can take on of a larger dinosaurs as a pack. Ooh, Super Mimer's biting the big one against the Spino there. The relative's having a little tussle. Oh, there's Giganonosaurus. Haven't seen Giganonosaurus yet. Wait, what? Wait, why'd you kill it? Well, apparently this Triceratops decided to kill Woosaurus. Oh, bless him. He's not quite a strong one. <laughs> not strong compared to this one. Well, Triceratops getting an unnecessary kill there. Quetzal, ooh, Quetzal's coming down to drink. Oh, look at it. Look how big it is, scaring off the Sukumimus. He's like, yes, my fishy. Wow, look at it, massive compared to the Suko. Well oversized in this game. I know it was, re it was tall, it was more tall than massive. Ooh, oh, look at that, Carcharodontosaurus. Just caught that, biting the big one against Daspletosaurus. Oh, the firebomb doing major damage. Wait, how strong was our Daspletosaurus? This thing's got 600 dominance. Where is it? Is it this one? I th oh, yeah, it got to be this one. Okay, yeah, 300 attack. 380 dominance. Okay, yeah, this one's definitely going to be the alpha one. <laughs> Daspletosaurus is starting strong. Well, so far, none of the herbivores have died. None of the herbivores have been killed yet like the ones that are oh hang on Kamarasaur is getting attacked by a giga there having a little nibble yes not so invincible now are you buddy no but for your sake I do hope Frontier will make will allow you to fight ooh dealt the Dromius taking on oh hang on I want to watch this one oh there goes a Carnotaurus taken out by a T-Rex and let's go back up to here we are Bert with Gorgas Despletosaurus defeating the Delta Dromius and giving it laceration. Oh, oh bless, it is the weak one as well. Wow, this our Bert this this Despletosaurus starting strong. Oh no, oh no! One of the baby Myers has died. Oh bless his souls. Oh, <laughs> this is what's gonna happen. Oh, here we go. You can... All the victims are getting killed. There goes a para. <laughs> I like that the Carnotaurus just sits there and watches. He's like, yes. Good job, my friend. Ooh, here we go. Another fight between... Oh, no. Another another Deinonychus biting the dust against the Monolophosaurus. Oh! <laughs> Look at that. He's taking the car with him. <laughs> Monolophosaurus, you thug. <laughs> It just destroyed that car. Ooh, hang on, hang on. Ooh, we get to see a skydive. 
It's a skydive, the quest! Killing the Myasaura! Finally, we got to see it! The quest killing a dinosaur! Oh, that makes it all worth it. Right, let's clear all this garbage, shall we? Oh no! Does Pterosaurus lean a smack down on Pachycephalosaurus? Oh, rip. Yes, this will be one of my next projects, is to make sure that these things can fight. And yep, there goes another para. Killed by Delta Dromius. Oh, and, and a T-Rex killing another... Ooh, hang on. Here we go. Oh no! Not the God One and Titan! No! No! Oh. <laughs> Why? Why? He's only a little sauropod, you poor little thing. Oh, he's like drowning and like, ugh. <laughs> oh, that Monolophosaurus, I think, is about to kill another baby Maya. And yes, that's another kill for the uh, T-Rex. Ooh, Tajongosaurus killed by Majungasaurus here. Wow, all these fights are happening at the same time. It's <laughs> kind of annoying. <laughs> Giganotosaurus, haven't... Oh, look at this guy's dominance. Ooh, hang on. We got a pack hunt. And it's one Deinonic has taken on a para. As a T-Rex. Have a look. Oh, he's already consumed it. That was quick. Don't mess with Myasaura. Well, you can mess with her in this game because she can't fight back. Wow, these Displinosauruses are doing really good. Right, let's get back to this uh, pack hunt, shall we? I think it's this one by here, yeah. And apparently it's just one... One Deinonic has taken on a para. Can the para hold her own? Like, the para doesn't seem that interested. Ooh, ooh. Wait, what? They killed it? <laughs> one Deinonic has killed the para. You little bully. You little bugger. Ah. <laughs> Again, overwhelmed by all these fights. Right, we saw Giganonosaurus against Sukamimus. Where is that? Oh, oh, I think the Camarasaurus got killed by the Giga. Ah, here it is, I think. Wait, what? Wait, what? Did, when did this happen? Did he get internal bleeding? Well, apparently this Giganonosaurus is going to die. Oh, oh, there goes another Pentaceratops. And there goes another Deinonychus. Wow, Monolophosaurus really dominating these Deinonychus thus far. I think that's kind of a good thing as well, because if all the Deinonychus survive and pack hunt, with the broken st trait effects and broken stats, the Deinonychus pack could be a bit too OP. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Oh no! Oh no, there goes the other one. <laughs> there goes the other gone one of Titan. You little bully! That's, I, think, I think this guy's killed them both. <laughs> what a bully. Ooh, hello. We got a secret clash here. And it's Pachycephalosaurus going down to the Deinonychus. Killed him next to the other one. I think that's the one the Displetosaurus killed earlier. Oh, this Storacosaurus dead. Wow, this Metriacamphosaurus is strong. Okay, not as strong as that one. And yet, there it goes. I don't know what caused it. I think it might have been the Suko. But the Giga, one of the Gigas died to the internal bleeding. And wow, this Majungasaurus. Another kill for this Maj... Oh, wow. Look at, look at the... <laughs> 1,500 dominance. 300 attack. Another possible Dark Horse. Oh, oh is that... Is that... Is that... Is that... Is that dead? I think it's going to be... Ooh, he gets a hit on the T-Rex. But yeah, I think the mono the Wuasaurus is going to die. Yeah, there it goes. T-Rex taking no prisoners. Smacking him down. A triumphant, victorious roar. And is that another Delta Dromius dead? Indeed it is. Wow, Delta Dromius number two. Killed by another Displetosaurus. Well, it's not been a good debut for the Displetosaurus. Oh, oh, he like, threw him against the fence. Ooh, wait, is this the dominant Majungasaurus? Ooh, it is. Well, it's a dominant one. I mean, look at that. Ooh, this could be an interesting fight, even though the T-Rex should win. Oh, there goes another Monolophosaurus. How many of these guys have we got left? We have got two left. Oh, and this one's just killed the Deinonychus. Oh, the Quet's coming down there. Ooh, we got Stegosaur clashing, yes? 
Oh, look, the Tajongosaurus, I think, killed the... Uh, the Woosaurus killed the Tajongosaurus. Oh, look at this. Delta Dromius hunting the Pachycephalosaurus. I think. If it can get to... Oh, wait, it failed? Wait, he escaped? Wait, did it... Wait, did he fail? I've never seen that before. Like, I, I don't think I've ever seen a, a hunt actually fail. Moral victory for the Pachycephalosaurus. He was too quick. Oh, unlike the Myasaurus. <laughs> the Delta Dromius made up for his mistake. Wait, we've got one left, haven't we? Oh, no, we got two. No, he, he really wants to kill the Pachycephalosaurus. Let's have a look here. Ooh, Iguanodon against Dasplitosaurus. But the Dasplitosaurus have done pretty well so far, so I feel like this is going to be the end of Iguanodon. Ooh, maybe not. Wait, hang on. Wait, is Iguanodon going to win? No, no, I, I'll, I'll, get, I'll get a chance to see that. Ooh, the Iguanodon fighting off this Pletosaurus. What are your stats? 200 attack. Do not mess with Iguanodon. And I think another Hama the baby Maya just died. But we do have a few left. We got four left in it all up here. Oop, the Tajongosaurus taking on Pentaceratops here is, again, like the Delta Dromius, a Tajongosaurus really struggling so far to make an impact. Oh, well, this one's definitely dead. He's only got 3% health. Oh, he gets a cheap hit, though. But yeah, go on, Pentaceratops. You can finish. Okay, he's got a major fracture. He's dead. Oh, no. Run, Pachycephalosaurus. Run. Don't just walk away. He's like, yes, I'll walk away. Yup, damn. <laughs> dead and buried. Apparently, these herbivores just like fighting against each other. Ooh, is Spinosaurus square enough against something over there? These Stegosaurus are not doing very well so far. Oh yes, I think we are going to see it. Spinosaurus taking on Delta Dromius. Oh, look at that! Delta Dromius smashed into bits. Not even a contest. It's like it, full HP Delta Dromius smacked down in seconds by the Spino. Oh, finally! Oh, well, I was going to say, finally, Ankylosaurus is getting in on the act, but it's dead. <laughs> Cacherodontosaurus taking no prisoners. I haven't seen... Wow. <laughs> Two thousand base... Well, dominance. Wow. That's got to be the highest so far. Wait, is this the dominant Majungasaurus? Well, he's kind of dominant. But this Giga is more dominant, so I suspect this Giga will win. Oh, look at that, fighting among the trees. Yum! But yeah, Giganonosaurus easily defeating Majungasaurus there. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what happened? I think, wait, was that the Majungasaurus? Wait, oh, he killed that! Majungasaurus killed the Displetosaurus. Another dominant Majungasaurus. Not as dominant as the other one. And yeah, no surprise there. Look at the stats of that dude. And then this guy's stats. No surprise there that the uh, Majungasaurus won. Ooh, Carnotaurus taking on a T-Rex. Will this Carnotaurus avoid the fate of the other two Carnos that fought the T-Rexes? Probably not. Oh, Quetz are in the background there. And yeah, this Carnotaurus... <laughs> This T-Rex, no match for the T-Rex. Just like in the anime. Ooh, can Woohoosaurus get a kill? Whoa, yeah, he got it! Woohoosaurus, finally the Stegosaurus get a kill. And he kills the Triceratops. Good job there, Woohoosaurus. Finally, a Stegosaur actually gets a kill. Oh, you, you were quite a strong Triceratops. Let's have a look at you. Oh, look at this guy, though. 400 dominance, 260 attack, and 119 defense. Oh, oh, there goes another para. I think that's the last of them. Wasting the Parasaurolophus in seconds. Yes, but it doesn't increase your dominance, buddy, because that para is a weakling. Oh, 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 
there goes another Pentaceratops. Dealt the Dromius getting a kill. I think that's the first actual kill a Dealt the Dromius has got. Wow, these Pentaceratopses are really weak. Wow, look at the... Hang on a minute. This guy got 1,000 dominance, but he just couldn't survive. Wait. This Pentaceratops, however, has killed Metriaganthosaurus. Ooh, is this the dominant Majungasaurus here? Well, so it doesn't look dominant so far. Super Mime is getting a hit there. Can't highlight this guy. Oh, that Super Mime has got laceration. Okay, that Super Mime has done. And I think, yeah, it is. Well, this is one of the dominant Majungasauruses. Ooh, and is this one the other one? Well, it's one of the other ones, yeah, but it's not doing well against this T-Rex. I mean, it shouldn't win against the T-Rex. Look at it. It could break, pull its head off. But none of that matters in this game. Yum. Oh, yeah, there it is. Absolutely no chance against this dominant beast of a T-Rex. Ooh, Iguanodon taking on our boot uh, Despletosaurus there. Ooh, look, <laughs> that our uh, Despletosaurus is pushing along the um, Gyrosphere. Ooh, ooh, Despletosaurus getting a bite there. Cheeky little love bite. Tanking a firebomb. Look at that. Impale. Down goes Despletosaurus. And is that kill number two for the Iguanodon? No, I think it's just kill number one. Wait, what? Wait, T-Rex died to Wooasaurus? No, damn it, I missed it. Oh, wow, oh my god, this thing's got three kills. This thing's an absolute savage. Hang on, how have I missed this? It's a Tyrex. <laughs> this Wooasaurus has killed three dinosaurs. Has three victories, has one defeat, and is tyrant infamy level. A dark horse, perhaps? <laughs> how, how have I missed this? Ooh, here we go. The big clash of the lot to Spinosaurus against the T-Rex. Ooh, who's going to win this one? I don't know, because both of them have very close stats. But I think the T-Rex has fought more, so I feel like the T-Rex will have the edge here. Ooh, maybe not. Okay, maybe not, though. The Spinosaurus did get the first hit. And well, it's Kendrosaurus. We haven't seen anything of Kendrosaurus. Has yet to do anything, really. Oh, oh, there goes. Is this another Ankylosaurus dead? Yes, it is. <laughs> and that is the dominant Majungasaurus killing the Ankylosaurus and Pentaceratops. Wait, this guy's got two kills. He's killed another Metriacanthosaurus. Wow, this is this has been so chaotic. So many unexpected outcomes because of how because of all the broken traits and that. Well, that Metriacanthosaurus had organ trauma anyway, so it stood little chance against this Ceratosaurus. Oh, and he, oh, he's the last one standing. But yeah, ooh, can Dalt the Dromius get some revenge on the uh, Despletosaurus? I think he's going to. And he does, defeating the Despletosaurus and forcing him to retreat with a broken claw. Yeah, you don't mess with this Delta Dromius. He may be the only one left, but he is a very powerful one. Up, oh, up, oh, there goes Ceratosaurus, killed by Spinosaurus. Not even a contest. Well, I have to say, these Ankylosauruses, as I was saying earlier, have been a real disappointment. Given that I think they actually are the most, the strongest herbivores stat-wise in this game, behind Therizinosaurus. It's been a real letdown from Ankylosaurus, but as I said, all these stat, all these broken trait effects and that change everything. Ooh, are we going to have a square off between Cochiridontosaurus and T-Rex? I think we're going to. Indeed we are! Ooh, a clash from the anime again. And it's Cochiridontosaurus getting the first hit. But the T-Rex does strike back there with that neck crusher. And they have their little cuddles. But I think his Cochirodontosaurus is going to come out on top. And indeed he does. Oh, that's it. T-Rex is gone. 
He's got organ trauma. That is the T-Rex dead and buried. No match for the dominance of this Carcharodontosaurus. Who I'd probably say is going to be one the, up there with a spy note with a chance to win this. Ooh. Ooh. Majun we got this Predosaurus taking on the Majungasaurus there. Is this the dominant one? Ooh, it is the dominant one. But despite having the... Oh, no, this is... Wait, wait, he's healed. Well, despite everything, this this dominant Majungasaurus is going to lose and has organ trauma, so he's going to die. And it's this Predosaurus winning the round. Proving his superiority over the Majungasaurus there, just like fire dinosaurs prove their superiority over wind dinosaurs. Oh, look at this Ceratosaurus killing Carnotaurus. They are allies no more. Wow, that Ceratosaurus wasn't even that good. But I think this is the this was the Carnotaurus that had um, the organ trauma. 90, 30, 85, 90. Okay, yeah, this one actually has way better stats. Even though the Carnotaurus had a lot more dominance. Dominance isn't everything. Oh, no! No! The Baby Maya, the last of the Baby Mayas, is about to be consumed by the Giganonosaurus. And <laughs> look at him, and he's like looking at it, he's like, yes, yes. Come to me, little snack, come to me. Yum! No! Run, little fella! Run your little chicken legs off! Run! No! Yum! Um! Um! Well, they lasted longer than I thought they would, so credit to them. But that is it for the Baby Myers. Wait, is this going to be a kill for Kentrosaurus? Because this T-Rex is the one with the organ trauma and he's squaring off against the Kentrosaurus. Wait, it might, it might actually be... Oh, no, nope, never mind. <laughs> Even with organ trauma, a Kentrosaurus is still no match for a T-Rex. Oh, hang on, the cock is coming over here. He's like... How dare you pick on little dinosaurs like that? Come and pick on someone your own size. Ooh, we got a big clash up here between the Giganonosaurus and Delta Dromius. Can the Delta Dromius hang in there against this Giga, or will the Giga prove too strong? Gained an energy boost from the Baby Maya earlier. Ooh, this is going to be a this could be a very tight contest. Can't tell who's winning right now, but it looks like the Giga has won and the Delta Dromius has laceration, which means it is going to die. So yeah, a lot of dinosaurs dying from uh, injuries sustained in battles. Will anyone pick off this T-Rex or will it just die? I think it's just going to plop dead. T-Rex dying of organ trauma, not much it can do. I mean, normally I would interfere and heal it up, but we don't do that here. Oh, oh, lovely, the car... Wait, did the Carcharodontosaurus do that? No, I think the Carnotaurus just plopped as well. Is that the last Carnotaurus? I think it is. Oh, yes, it is. So that means Carnotaurus is out. Oh, oh there goes another Kentrosaurus. Kentrosaurus finally getting some action in this bat in this video. Mainly dying. Wait, hang on a minute. Is this Ruosaurus going to add another kill to its roster? Yes, it is. Down goes Delta Dromius. Well, the Ruosaurus definitely impressing on his debut as for the delta dromius well it, it did all right actually it's it had a slow start but it got when it got going it was pretty good but the wooosaurus proving too strong and look at that four kills four kills oh there's another kentrosaurus biting the dust wow just went just when i say they haven't been doing anything they all die at once Ooh, Iguanodon taking on the uh, Ceratosaurus, and this one's the dominant one. This one's the MVP, but he has been badly beaten, unlike this Ceratosaurus, so I hold very little hope for him. Ooh, give him a little jab. Come on, Iguanodon, you can do it. No, I, uh, no, I think this is going to be it. This Iguanodon's not doing so hot this time. Will he retreat? Oh, he's not going to retreat. He's going to get another hit as a Triceratops emerges. But yeah, Ceratosaurus definitely won that fight. 
85 to 93. Ooh, quite a close match, actually. Oh, here we go. Spinosaurus taking on Majungasaurus. I think this is the uh, the less dominant Majungasaurus, but still a powerful one indeed. But not as powerful as this Spinosaurus. But Majungasaurus definitely holding his own, but he's on low health. Is this going to be it? Oh, no, no. Majungasaurus getting a cheap, cheap little love kiss. But yes, no contest here. Spinosaurus yet again winning. Ooh, we got a matchup between these two apexes. Giganonosaurus against Kakirodontosaurus. Who will come out on top? And so far, it looks like the Giga's coming out on top. Both of these two have very high dominance. 75 to 80. So the Kark is still on top, actually. Ooh, they're, they're standing down. They're standing down. But Kakirodontosaurus did have the edge there. Oh, finally, some action for the Triceratops. Taking on the Tajongosaurus. Wow, these two Jongasauruses haven't done too well. I think one of them killed something else, and that's about it. But, oh yeah, this Triceratops has been quite dominant so far. And will he finish the job? Oh, no, he doesn't. Okay, they're going to stop this, so we'll get back to this fight. Ooh, round two between these two. Round one went to the Kark, and I sense that round two will go to the Kark. Yep. Kakirodontosaurus winning round two there. Getting hungry, though. Although, it's a very even contest, in fairness. Oh, no! No, the Iguanodon killed. Oh, it's all right. That's the weak one, anyway. <laughs> that thing stood no chance. Ooh, the carnivore's getting hungry, because I removed all the feeders. Ooh, there goes Ceratosaurus. The last Ceratosaurus. Oh, no, it's not the last one. There's two left. But one Ceratosaurus going down to Majungasaurus. We still got one Ceratosaurus alive over here. Wait, what? Wait, what happened? No! The dominant Kakirodontosaurus falling to Wuosaurus. This thing is in... Okay, this thing is OP. Five kills. Five kills from the Wuosaurus. Killed the dominant Kakirodontosaurus. How on earth did that happen? Oh, hello. We got Deinonic... Oh, no! The last of the Deinonychus killed by Storacosaurus. But Carcharodontosaurus biting the dust against the Wuosaurus. Spinosaurus taking on Ankylosaurus here. Yeah. Is that Ankylosaurus dead? Oh, he survived. Boar! Right in the shoulder blade of the Spino. And Ankylosaurus finally putting up a fight there. Wait, did he win? Ooh, well, the Spinosaurus took a beating, but the Ankylosaurus has internal bleeding, which will seal its fate. Wait, you're losing health as well. But that's because you're hungry. So this Spinosaurus needs to eat soon, or it's going to starve. Ooh, Majungasaurus picking a fight with Ceratosaurus. Can he finish off the Ceratosaurus, or will the Ceratosaurus get its revenge, avenge the other Ceratos' death? I mean, so far, it looks like Ceratosaurus is quite on top. Ceratosaurus did pretty well last time. And oh, yeah, there it is. This Majungasaurus is going to bite the big one. Despite having a thousand dominance, internal bleeding is going to finish him off. Um, yeah, I'm actually thinking about it. I think, I think the herbivores are going to win because there's only a few carnivores left. And, well, Majungasaurus is dying. So, it's just three left. Cerato. Spino and Giga. And for some reason, the carnivores keep fighting each other. I mean, yeah, look, yeah, he's, he's hang on a minute, he's fighting the uh, Ceratosaurus. Oh, Spinosaurus getting the first hit in there. Spinosaurus, one of the long lasting apexes. Ooh, but the Ceratosaurus does get a hit. Now, if these two are on low health, they could get picked off by something. So if, if all the carnivores die. I'm going to have to give this as a victory to whichever herbivore has the most kills, which I think is the Wuosaurus. And yet, there it is. Ceratosaurus gone. Organ trauma. Spinosaurus winning the fight. Is, is this the end of a Guanodon? Yeah, I think it's going to be the end of a Guanodon. Oh, I think it's the dominant one as well. Oh, I'll tell you what, though. He does get a hit on the Giga. Fair play to it. He does do some damage. 
But yeah, I think that's going to be. He's on, he's on really low health. This Giga's on pretty high health. But I tell you what, he does some damage to it, and he's got a concussion, which is might actually help it because it won't fight and it won't. It'll have low energy, so it might help it actually. Might help it recover its HP quicker. But yeah, this Giganonosaurus doing well. Oh, there goes another Triceratops. Yeah, this is the dominant Woosaurus killing the Triceratops. Yeah, so hopefully we'll get some fights now that I moved all these buggers over here. Oh, there's the Quetz. Choo -choo. Oh, no. Ah, what's happening? No, the Quetz is coming for me. Bruh, attack it. Kill it. Shoot it down. Shoot it down. Shoot it down. Shoot down the Quetz. Shoot him down, shoot him down, boosh! Down she goes. Oh, oh, is that the last Tajongosaurus? I think it is. Killed by a Triceratops, and a Triceratops finally kills something. And yet, that is the last of the uh, Tajongosauruses, which kind of disappointed, to be honest. Oh, is this the end of Iguanodon? Yeah, there it is. I think that's the end of Iguanodon. No chance to heal. This Spinosaurus kills it. Yeah, no chance there. <laughs> oh no, the other Iguanodon killed by Displetosaurus. No repeat of the miraculous win this time for Iguanodon. Wait, I forgot we got Displetosaurus. I actually forgot about this guy. <laughs> so we got Giganonosaurus left, Spinosaurus left, and Displetosaurus left, and a butt ton of herbivores left. Well, let's not count this guy out. The dominant Woosaurus has killed six dinosaurs, a true savage in the making. Ooh, ooh, is the Giganonosaurus squaring off against it? I think he is. Yes, he is. Is that a mistake? Is that... Could that be a costly mistake? The bye animation... Bye. Oh. <laughs> it just, it just, did it just flop in one hit? One-shotted by the Woosaurus. I mean, it just, the Woosaurus just looked at it and it died. <laughs> wow. If, if Woosaurus is your favourite dinosaur, leave, leave a comment down below if you like Woosaurus. What an absolute beast. Like, how is this thing not max infamy? It's killed seven, it's killed Giga, it's killed Kark, it killed the T-Rex. It's killed, it's killed like all the big carnivores. This thing's a monster. Ooh, Spinosaurus taking on Pentaceratops and killing Pentaceratops, knocking it over and killing it instantly. The poor Tricer the Pentaceratops with concussion. And that, I think, was the last Pentaceratops. Um, oh, no, we got one left. Oh, we got a pretty strong one. Oh, yeah, this one that killed the uh, two metric Amphosauruses earlier. Forgot about him. Oh, no, what are you doing, this Pleosaurus? You're fighting the dominant Woosaurus and you're getting shredded. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> What is happening? This Woosaurus has killed this Pleosaurus. It's, it's just killing Enemy everything. Has been slain. <laughs> oh, I, I, I have to save this guy. I have to save this guy for a, another battle. Because look at this. It doesn't even have that many traits. It's just strong and defensive. But apparently it, it's made a huge impact. This Woosaurus. Wow. Ooh, we got a fight between Spinosaurus and Triceratops. And there goes the Triceratops. Oh wow, this was a very weak Triceratops, especially compared to the Spino. No contest here, Triceratops going down. Ooh, wait, 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 could this change everything? The Woosaurus has been hit by Triceratops. Ooh, this is the Alpha Triceratops, the dominant Triceratops. But Woosaurus has considerable battle experience, whereas the Triceratops does not, so I su suspect that will help it. Or will it? A twist in the tail here. The dominant Woosaurus has killed the T-Rex. It's killed the Spletosaurus. It's killed Carcharodontosaurus. It's killed Giganontosaurus. It's probably killed Sukamimus. I think it killed Delta Dromius. But it's got a minor fracture, which means it is up for... Well, it is up for grabs. Ooh, we got round two. The Woosaurus recovered from its injury to take on the Triceratops. This time, this well, this Triceratops doesn't seem as strong as the other one. It's pretty strong, but not as strong as the uh, the one that beat it before. 
Whoa, yeah, no contest there. Another Triceratops bites the dust against Wuasaurus. <laughs> He's like, yes. You do not mess with me. Well, it's taken a while, but we finally get some action. And it is the Alpha Triceratops taking on Wuasaurus. Is this the end for Wuasaurus? Despite all its efforts, despite all its victories, will it will it fall here? Has the victories gone in gone to its head? I think it has. I think it's going to be the end for Wuasaurus. Oh, it gets a cheeky little hit, but Triceratops definitely on top here. And surface wounds. That's gonna lower its health. The Tyrant Wuasaurus is in trouble. The Dominant Triceratops looking good. Oh, is this the end? Yeah, this, this has to be the end of Wuasaurus. It's defeated the T-Rex. It's killed Kakirodontosaurus. It's killed Giganonosaurus. It's killed Despletosaurus. But still, it's no match for Spinosaurus. I mean, it, it, it didn't help that it had only 20% HP. It was easy pickings for Spinosaurus and Wuasaurus, despite his efforts, despite his kills. Well, it's lost quite a few fights, actually. But despite everything, falls to the Spinosaurus. And that puts Wuasaurus in sixth place, which means our top five are Staracosaurus, Spinosaurus, Kentrosaurus, Pentaceratops, and Triceratops. And out of those lot, I think Triceratops has the best chance. So yeah, I know that this, these two can fight each other and they choose not to. These two, I think, can fight each other. So yeah, it's uh, gonna be in, it's gonna be intriguing to see which one of these pulls away. Well, it has literally taken half an hour. Um, well, yeah, <laughs> it's taken literally half an hour for this Spinosaurus to start fighting. And, yeah, it died to the Triceratops. <laughs> oh, it fell short at the last hurdle in the last Battle Royale, but this time the Triceratops gets his revenge on the Spinosaurus. I'm going to say, by virtue of the fact that the Triceratops killed the Spino, I'm going to give it to Triceratops, and the fact that two of them have survived as well, whereas there's only one Pentaceratops. But I will say, Pentaceratops will get second place, so... If, if you like lightning dinosaurs, then this is the video for you. It's taken ages. I don't know what was happening. The Spinosaurus, for some reason, even though it was starving to death, would just not fight. It was just not going to fight. And, well, these two ain't going to fight. So, yeah, I'm going to say the Triceratops wins. Pentaceratops in second place. And the Spinosaurus in third. And, oh, my God, I think it's been almost two hours since I started this video. So, yeah. But don't worry, it won't be two hours long. I'll definitely be trimming it down. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I know it's been a long haul, but I thanks for watching. And until next time, this is Strainer Gamer signing out.